For breaking news out of Sevier County tonight, we have just learned in the last half an hour, a man faces murder charges in the case of a 15 year old shot and killed outside a hotel. Officers responded to the Americana Inn on the parkway just before midnight. People near the scene tell 10 News they heard a boy crying out for help. He was taken to the hospital where he later died. 10 News reporter Mary Klingler talked to witnesses on the parkway. She joins us live in the newsroom with what she's learned in just minutes. Mary. Yeah, Robin John police just released the suspect's identity less than 30 minutes ago. His name is Andrew Ortiz and he hasn't been booked yet, but we're working to get his mugshot right now. However, cameras at the hotel next door got video of the shooting and this video is not gruesome, but we want to warn you it may be disturbing to some viewers. This video shows the front left end of the parking lot. You can see a man and a woman standing next to a hatchback and at 1154 last night he walks to the back and opens the trunk. The vehicle starts driving off and that's when the suspect pulls out a gun and starts firing into the back of the car. And next thing you know, pop, 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 and the police were just surrounding the place. Police say the shooting killed a 15 year old boy. They're investigating all the leads and trying to figure out exactly what happened. Pigeon Forge Police Captain Dennis Adams says murders are rare in this town. It's a, a nice community. You know, people on vacation, but we really are not having you know, stuff like this happen. We were just sitting out here, and then there's there's some gunshots over here next door. People staying at the Americana Inn say they heard it all. My old lady just dead bolted the door, and we was laying down. They had their guns out and everything. But the clearest picture of what happened comes from the hotel security cameras next door. I didn't see it when it happened. I heard it when it happened, but then right after that, we watched security cameras and it was all on security cameras. Randy Gibson says police responded to the gunfire in less than a minute. We don't know what the whole deal was, but they're stay evidently we're staying next door at the Americana. Um, a male and a female talking to somebody in a car. Next thing you know, gun comes out. Five shots later. Now this case is still under investigation. We will keep you updated as we continue to learn more. Guys, back to you. Mary Klingler on the story. Thank you, Mary.